Hello everyone and welcome to my Days of Our Lives official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Recognizing Horton Family, 3D Trip, Double Hijacking, Everett's cover-up Days of Our Lives for the coming two weeks are in. From February 19th to March 1st, anticipate the cleaner to recognize the Horton family as they go through the fiery tragedy. Plans to rebuild will commence, so that's commodity to look forward to. Plus, Teresa Donovan and Brady Black take a trip together. Trip Johnson and Wendy Shin are held hostage. Plus, Jada Hunter explodes as Stephanie Johnson doesn't know who to believe. 3D Visit Tate Black DOL reveal that 3D will go to Southern Illinois to visit Tate Black. While Teresa and Brady's main concern is Tate, there's a chance they will do some further reconnecting as well. Teresa might open up to Brady about Alex Kiriaki's non-proposal. Still, Brady and Teresa could end up in each other's arms again. DOL double hijacking during the week of February 19th, Trip and Wendy are abducted. A man with dark hair and a short ponytail cinches Trip and Wendy into some kind of fault. The couple are seen holding each other as they rest for the night. The looks on their faces are forlornness and query. There's only a thin, slate covering to keep them warm. Meanwhile, Ava Vitali tells Ray Fernandez about her deal with Harris Michaels. Over at Statesville, Clyde Weston processed Stefan DiMera. Weekdays of our lives reveal that Everett Lynch plays dumb with Jada Hunter. Still, Jada provides a print to prove Everett is Bobby Stein. Meanwhile, Steve Johnson provides substantiation to Stephanie Johnson that Everett and Bobby are the same man. Sloan Peterson Brady drunk gripes to Melinda Trask about Eric Brady. Still, she could have a one-night stage if Sloan gets drunk enough. Days of our lives next two weeks recognizing Horton family, 3D trip, double hijacking, Everett's cover-up suckers can also anticipate a special that's supposed to be each about the Horton family history. Indeed, Leo Stark gets in on the Salem's royalty adventure. Days of our lives next two weeks during the Harris should wake up. While Burton is formerly gone from DOL, Harris will stick around for a little while longer. Still, Harris might not be suitable to tell any information about the shooter. There should also be some further details about Constantine Melioni's and John Black's plot. Stephanie will have a decision to make about Everett. After getting exposed, Everett will presumably claim that his passions for Stephanie were oh so real. Stephanie would be a fool to believe him, but it's a cleaner, so let's see what happens. Young Tom and Alice Horton, Steve's proof, Trip's hostage crisis, Everett slash Bobby exposed days of our lives reveal that an exercise clip has been released. It shows a youthful Tom Horton and Alice Horton. Steve Johnson has evidence of Everett Lynch's true identity. Plus, Clyde Weston has Trip Johnson and Wendy Shin abducted. Keep reading to find out what's coming up in the Peacock Cleaner pieces. Days of Our Lives Young Tom Horton and Alice Horton DOL reveal that the exercise clip features Tom and Alice Horton. After the Horton house is burnt, Julie Williams and Doug Williams visit the scorched remains. Days of Our Lives preview Young Tom and Alice Horton, Steve's proof, Tripp's hostage crisis, Everett slash Bobby exposed that must be where a stretch box is uncovered, which could have prints and memorials from Tom and Alice. In any case, anticipate to see Tom and Alice's love story. DOL Trip Johnson's hostage crisis during, anticipate Ava Vitali and Kayla Johnson to be full of fear. Kayla learns that Trip no way showed up to the sanitarium from work. Also, Ava begs Ray Fernandez for help chancing Trip. Ava is so hopeless that she indeed tells Rafe about her deal with Harris Michaels. Also read, DOL Jada explodes, her double date implodes? The daily exercise clip shows a mysterious gangster locking Wendy and Trip down. Sealed in some kind of vault, will they be saved before it's too late? Days of Our Lives Steve Johnson's proof Days of Our Lives spoilers for the week of February 19th reveal that the exercise clip also shows what happens with Everett. Jada Hunter declares that Everett is Herrick's husband, Bobby Stein. Still, Everett probably denies knowing what Jada is talking about. That leads to Jada defying Everett with evidence that they were together. Meanwhile, Steve shows Stephanie substantiation that Everett really is Bobby. 
DOL during suckers can also anticipate Stephanie to feel torn about Everett. As Everett coolly strolls in the door, Jada begs Stephanie to run. Just how bad is this Joe and what does it mean for Jada as well as Stephanie's futures? Still, also how to put him away before it's too late? Could Everett intimately be on Clyde's payroll? If Everett really is a bad dude. Clyde's wrathfulness, Stefan's warning Ava's fear? Days of our lives and updates T. Stefan Demara's warning about Clyde Weston's wrathfulness will beget Ava Vitali fear. Stefan will advise Ava about how dangerous Clyde gets when he's angry, and soon she LL realize her son Trip Johnson and his gal Wendy Shin are missing. Days of our lives Kayla Johnson realizes Trip Johnson missed his shift Kayla Johnson will be among the first to realize Trip is missing, it's not like him to miss his shift at the sanitarium. In the meantime, Stefan and Ava are continuing to be questioned in Harris Michaels, Steve Burton, firing which happened in the alley in the reverse of the bistro. Days of our lives spoilers Clyde's wrathfulness, Stefan's warning Ava's fear Ava set up him, nearly bled out and called to Trip, who had been still inside the eatery with Wendy, and Wendy called 911, Trip went with the ambulance to the sanitarium. Kayla told Ava that Harris had her down to call in case of exigency, which Ava hadn't realized ahead. Harris had no other coming of kin indeed though he grew up in Salem. DOL Stefan Demera and Ava Vitali Bandy Clyde Weston's temper Stefan and Ava Bandy Clyde's temper and Stefan suspects Clyde is behind Harris firing and the Horton House fire Stefan would end put either incident past him. Stefan is sure Ava knows how Chad Demera set up his woman. Abigail Demera after Clyde got frenetic and killed her he did that kill himself. He nearly ripped her apart with the cutter and she bled out on her and Chad's bed what if one of their children had set up her? His crimes go back numerous, numerous times, and he'd a character of being an vituperative father as well, all the more reason to despise him. With both Harris and the Horton House it's plain maximum damage and injury had been intended. Days of our lives spoilers, death and destruction death and destruction are Clyde's hallmark, and when Ava finds out Trip is ent at the sanitarium and missed his shift, fear rises up. Stefan fears what might be to his woman. Gabby Hernandez, most lately Camila Banis, in Statesville, Clyde controls the whole captivity. Ava is asked if she's heard from her son and she has and Steve Johnson's, Stephen Nichols, is communicated too. Stefan and Ava also learn Wendy is missing they went missing right after the geocaching event in Horton Town Square. She did and report to her shift at the Salem PD either, and now everyone's certain Clyde's behind it all. Stephen Nichols celebrates his birthday on Days of Our Lives, Steve Johnson and Kayla just celebrated their anniversary with a lovely day. In the real world, Stephen Nichols is also celebrating a major corner. Happy birthday, Stephen Nichols, that's because he was born on February 19, 1951, in Cincinnati, Ohio, which means that this talented actor is turning 73 times old moment. Upon graduating from Meadowdale High School, Nichols declined an offered art education and rather joined the Tone Consummation Fellowship Center in Los Angeles, with intentions to come a monk. Three times latterly, he surfaced from the Vihara and began to pursue a career in the performing trades with the Theater Academy of Los Angeles City College as his stepping gravestone. After completing his studies, Nichols appeared in a number of stage shows most specially delirious, Pieces in Time, The Lizard King, Love Letters, and Death of a Salesperson, and won multitudinous laurels and accolades, including three Drama Logue Awards. His film debut was the 1978 romantic dramedy, A Different Story, and his first TV part was a bit part in Dynasty. Latterly, he appeared in Wizards and Soldiers, Dallas, T.J. Hooker, and Crazy Like a Fox, plus had major places in the Point Flicks Choices, House, and Witchboard. On June 13, 1985, he joined the cast of the NBC Day drama Days of Our Lives as Patch, a henchman for Victor Kiriakis in Time, his on-screen presence grew, and he was ultimately given a name, Steve Johnson, a family and a love interest in the form of Kayla Brady, played by Mary Beth Evans. After spending five times on the cleaner, Nichols decamped and searched for other systems. In time, he could be seen in occurrences of Matlock, L.A. Law, Murder She Wrote, and Renegade. His ties to cleaner pieces led to a gem in the movie Soapdish, as well as a recreating part on 2000, Malibu Road, a brief stint on Santa Barbara, and a sixth-time run as Stefan Cassidy on ABC's.